greetings from Finland. It is chilly, but glorious. <laughs> um, guys, I'm here not only with the wonderful Mike Betts, but obviously with the glorious Kevin John Jones. And most of you will know that Kev and Lydia Jones moved here about three years ago. Yeah. And it's been an amazing journey these last 36 months in terms of what ha God has done uh, with this family. Kev, it's been an amazing journey, hasn't it? Not just God adding new disciples after new disciples, but uh, even even this week, there's exciting things happening, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah so we've been here three years, as, as Tom said, and uh, I guess uh, things are a, things are a slow burn. And three three years in, it just feels that we're starting to gain a bit of momentum, and um, we've got our regular gatherings happening now on on Sundays, and uh, really kind of hitting into a, a bit of a groove with that which is so exciting uh, to see an actual gathering taking place um, when we just arrived it was just just our family meeting in the apartment and now we've got a, a crowd of people um, who, who enjoy being together enjoy um, enjoy what's happening um, amongst amongst us and uh, there's there's a real increase of momentum which is which is so great we've um, finally we finally pinned down uh, a name for the church which is going to come in really handy when we uh, when we talk to other people about the church and explain what we're doing um, not having a name was a bit of set us as a bit of a disadvantage <laughs> uh, so we're, we're going to be we're going to be called risen light church helsinki so we're right. really excited uh, to be um, announcing that on on sunday to the kind of wider family of the church Mm. That's great. Yeah. And uh, as you're looking ahead, are there any other exciting things happening or on the on the on the on the radar that are kind of you know high up in your heart and mind? Uh, just really, there's there's so much so much work to be done. So much work to be done, and uh, we're just really thrilled with what's happening. But it just feels like it's just a it's just a taste of of what what could happen in the future. And uh, even even in these last few days, we've been talking about uh, not only Helsinki but other cities and uh, just little kind of little contacts emerging under the ground there that we could begin to begin to maybe um, kind of assess uh, what that nature of that relationship could mean and uh, how we can be an encouragement mm. to those other situations as well. Mm. Right. Great. Just to say back in 2007 uh, Keith Hazel prophesied to me that God was going to open a door for for me into Finland and I used to come for a few years before that with conferences various things looking around just seeing what was we felt god was in it but we didn't quite know how it was going to work out and then in 2007 keith said that and we've been waiting kind of looking out since then thinking when lord when lord and just to hear what kevin lydia and the team with them are now doing it's like god is opening a door and i'm quite sure it's not just just the door into helsinki there's there's a whole whole lot of other stuff going to come from that and we really do believe god has spoken so just to encourage you, perhaps you're in, you want to be involved in pioneering. You may want to come and learn your craft here in Helsinki, learn how to church plant with a team that are doing it. You may have somewhere else on your heart that you want to be involved in. We just want to see a whole wave of pioneers in Western Europe, Northern Europe, because there's so much to do. It's like this wilderness mm. behind us. It's a spiritual wilderness yeah. that needs to be repopulated with a fresh spring and summer of the gospel being brought into birth. So think about whether you can be involved in pioneering please be praying whatever we've been praying enough in large numbers but please be praying for these guys and lots of the other pioneers and please be giving grassroots giving money actually makes the gospel have traction so we really want to encourage you there's some fantastic things going on here we honor these guys for all they're doing so you might want to get involved in that in all those three ways coming training being sent praying giving whatever let's see loads and loads of church plants emerging all across this vast wonderful continent of Europe together. Mm -hmm.